don't be cowardly. Just like the brand new OnePlus A's 3V, it's full of dominance. So what should we do? Firstly, it must be a more physical performance. The processor is Qualcomm Snapdragon 7 Plus Gen 3 with Android 14, also known as Little 8 Gen 3, which score 1.495 million. The measured Genshin impact and King Glory lasted for 30 minutes. The average frame rate was very stable. And because there was 9140 square millimeters of VC heating control was also good. Plus 550 milliampers of large batteries and 100 watts of super flash charge, it was very easy to play games. The second one is the sustained texture of a semi-submachine. The OnePlus Ace 3V brings a flagship texture glass rear bumper, along with the stainless steel protective ring and aluminum alloy base of the camera, and the narrow border of the 1.5 Kelvin Tiama U8 and straight screen on the front. The appearance and texture have once again been significantly improved. It stands out very much in this price range. The third is to arrange for the elimination of IGC, which is useful for daily use and AI capabilities. More importantly, there is also a brand new Zyabu AI Assistant video script social platform copywriting AI drawing that is not a problem. It can even become your English teacher to practice speaking with you, which is a bit practical and released together with your phone. There are also Bluetooth earphones with extremely high cost performance. The OnePlus 8 to V lightweight and rounded design is suitable for long-term wear. The sound quality of the 12.4mm popular circle is also good, and playing games with OnePlus Ace 3V has lower latency and better experience. OnePlus Ace 3V really doesn't make any sense. I really started working hard in the terminal, upgrading is very practical, and the addition of AI is more intelligent. I like it and it's worth exploring.